getting shot oh, at, and uh, I have no guns. Oh, shit! What's up? No, oh, this like, thing. Board, board game. That's my chance. Come on. Am I on a time limit? I could use your help, Nathan. Right and yeah, stay down. What the shit? Ah. What's the plan? I'm working on it. Come on, Where? Ready? We gotta go up to get out. Didn't we? Yeah, we kicked it, punched it, and set it on fire. <laughs> Is that all they have are pistols? Do they not have like anything else? Nathan, come on! Yo, don't tell me what to do. Don't talk to me like that. I see more of them. <laughs> I look like he had an AK, but that's a shoddy. I might want to save the shoddy ammo for something else. There might be a boss, I don't know. I don't even know if there are bosses in this game. I was playing down any higher difficulty than normal, I would have died right there. In this game, you can only have uh, two guns in Uncharted 3. I think you could have like four. God damn it, mate. I can hear the fireworks from here. What the hell's going on? Long story. Short version is get us the hell out of here. Yeah, drink it. Hold tight. Be there as soon as I can. Okay. Oh, hell. Sam! Watch the turret! So far, so good. Dead. 
We're good on AK ammo. We have full pistol. We're good. Oh shit, Sam sniper! Find cover! Good shot, little brother. Where's the sniper? Use up all the pistol ammo. I'll take the uh, sniper. Let's use it. Oh, this replaces the AK? Yeah, we'll take it, sure. I do want to get some sniper shots in, though. Keep running! Don't stop! Is this how it always is for you? No! That's kind that of... That lock-on. Yeah! Yes! Yes, definitely! <laughs> Something tells me if we're taking another sniper. God, wasn't Victor saying the weather is lovely this time of year? I can't see shit! Just keep heading down until we hit the water! Uh. Yo, that was a weird Sam, angle. Down here. Forget about that, man. Keep moving. The one. <laughs> Running around with a sniper rifle isn't the best. Uh, yeah, we'll see about that. How did you get there? Weren't you just... You were just over there. What an F. Job. Now. Uh. Don't, you, don't they have like achievements for uh, getting X number of kills okay, here we go. Get ready! Oh, this is good.
That was a close one, huh? Just shut up my goddamn plane, mate. We're fine, thanks. How soon can you get us to Madagascar? No treasure, then. Not yet. I don't know what you're talking about. Look, we're rich. Jesus. Suppose it's a start. Do you think the rest is in Madagascar? Well, there was a chamber back there with a giant map of Madagascar on the floor, so... Yeah, it's probably there. This is beginning to smell a whole lot like wild goose, kid. Look, the treasure was never in Scotland, okay? Then what was the point of all that, huh? Of the St. Dismas Look, Cross? it's like I said. I think Avery was recruiting people. The cross was an invitation. The caves were just some sort of uh, initiation. Oh, so we all passed, huh? Congrats, Victor. We get eye patches and parrots now. I don't get it. Why the hell would they go to all that bother just to weed people out? To protect himself. Look, Avery was the most wanted man in the world at that time. He had to enlist people that he could trust in order to keep their treasure secret. What do you mean, their treasure? Just think about this. Thomas, too, was a successful pirate in his own right. What would he possibly stand to gain from joining Avery? I think Avery sent out crosses only to the other wealthy pirates like himself. What if they pooled and hid all their treasure together? That would make the guns way all look like chump change. Exactly. Oh, holy shit. Okay, so where exactly in Madagascar are we going? Kings Bay. It was an old pirate haven back in uh, Avery's time. I know it well. It's a big place. Anything more specific? Well, that map chamber completely caved in, so, you know. <laughs> what are you laughing about? The people who survived the caves. The recruits. What's the one thing they would have left with? There's a volcano on this. And there's a volcano near King's Bay. Which means we need to get a move on. That self-advertisement, Sony. I see you. Hey. Hey, Nate. Hi, honey. Oh, hi. I've been trying to get a hold of you. Are you okay? Yeah, of course. What do you mean? Well, you know the news. There's been all that flooding. Maybe going to Malaysia during the monsoon season wasn't such a good idea. Yeah, right. Right, yeah. It, uh, it grounded us for sure. You know, had some equipment failure, but, you know, no one's hurt or anything. Well, as long as you guys are safe. So, are you gonna start work tomorrow? Uh, postponed, actually. Uh, looks like we're gonna need maybe another 10 days or so. Ugh, 10 days? Hey, well, I, why don't I just uh, go ahead and buy a ticket then? Oh, uh, you know, you don't have to do that. That's fine. I mean, you know, these guys always overestimate things. So I'm sure it'll be less time than that. Okay, well, you know, don't rush. Make sure that you're safe. Oh, I will. Always do. Uh, listen, I, I'm, I'm sorry, I gotta go. Jameson's calling me over. Okay. I love you. Love you too. So much color. What are the satellites saying, Victor? Right now, not a goddamn thing. I lost the signal. Hey, you know what never loses signal? Paper. All right, this route right here should take us straight to the volcano. Might get a little bumpy, though. Let's get the show on the road. Okay. All right. Oh, we get to drive? So, what are we looking for out here? Well, the map shows all these structures around the volcano. Some abandoned outposts, a handful of watchtowers. Watchtowers? Avery was the most wanted man in the go? world. So if he was hiding something out here, it makes sense he'd need lookouts. One of those towers is right on the volcano. With Avery's treasure. I see some ruins up ahead.
Wait here. I'll go take a look. It doesn't tell you where to go. Oh, Still do it's just like, oh, days. you can stop, yeah, do whatever you want. I tend to pick jobs that get me away from the computer. <laughs> yeah, I was telling Nathan, it's shocking how much of the business has moved to the internet. I mean, I bet you have all sorts of options to get rid of Hawk Hoggle. Not much to see here. Yeah, sure, but I prefer talking to clients face to face. Get a good read on them. Well, ah, nothing worthwhile. Come on, let's keep going. What would happen if there were like... Hey, so with our luck, what are the odds this volcano is going to erupt on us? Zero. It's extinct. Trust me, that's the first thing I looked up when we said we were heading for a volcano. That and where to rent the cheapest four by. Wait, Sully, you're telling me that you actually did some research? Can't let you be the know-it-all every time, kid. map would be nice maybe direction that bridge there is what you would call rickety Fifty. okay so we have to cross that bridge so much color. Oh, this looks promising this looks like one of those come on come on baby here. Oh, let's go 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 well made it Okay, kid. Just don't drop us. I just keep it slow. Keep it in the center. Yeah, there's a lot of backseat driving going on. Ah! We're good. Everything's good. Jesus Christ. Yeah, we're never doing that again. The driving feels kind of smooth. Upward. Luckily, there aren't too many like random rocks in the road or something. Ah, we're getting nowhere fast. There are fucking mud obstacles like this. You need traction here. Nathan, the rocks. Uh. Not too many rocks. Okay, listen. I know. Reverse. Turn. All right, hang on, guys. I got it. I got it. Wait, what the? Oh, I thought that was another car tailing us. Okay, I think I'm getting the hang of this. There we go. Are you <laughs> now? Oh, Jesus. Oh, my spine. Where are we actually going, though? Something tells me we don't jump that. Ramp? Look, tire tracks. Someone came up this way. What the heck? What is that? Hey, look up there on the hill. Got a tower or something. Now we're talking. Uh. You destroyed it. Hey, Victor, what were you arguing with the rental guy about? Oh, your brother insisted on getting a 4x4 with a winch. So you sprung for the winch, but you couldn't spring for the suspension. I got it. Hey, it's important. We're going off-road. It might rain, might be muddy. How about we go through this whole goddamn thing and... Oh, See? shit. Huh. No. Oh, actually, we're kind of fine. <laughs> oh, hey! I actually got stuck on that. Hey, take this slow, kid. Yeah. Are those trees that are like rubber bands? You can't actually drive off, but... Hard to maneuver. So Nathan, you're thinking Avery, Two, and some other big shot pirates pulled their treasure and came out here because why exactly? Who knows? Maybe for protection? 
British authorities were closing in on him. Sure. Maybe uh, he helped them disappear. I mean, the guy clearly had a knack for hiding things. <clears throat> to be honest, I'm kind of just more surprised that I even found my way. Can you drive up this? And go! And no. That was a valiant effort. You turn and up. Something tells me we gotta get out. Let's go check out that tower. I'll come with. It's in pretty good shape for something several hundred years old. Yeah. They're definitely ruins from Avery's era. What? Sam, look. That's Christopher Condon's sigil. He's uh, captain of the Fiery Dragon. Operated out of Madagascar around Avery's time. So, maybe Avery recruits pirate captains to what be his lookouts? That don't make any sense. No, it doesn't. So where do we go now? Up. Oh. Huh. Bark stripped away. Something was wrapped around this tree. Yeah, probably rope to get the things up. Oh, that's disgusting. Oh, that's actually pretty good looking. It looks better when I'm playing it, though, than the stream. Or something we gotta toss around here. I'm not sure I understand. 